Objective To learn about the Dispersal of seeds Objective To learn about the types of seed dispersal in plants Plants produce a large number of fruits. Every fruit contains one or many seeds. If all these fruits fall and their seeds scatter under the parent plant, then the seeds would not get enough space to grow into a new plant and as a result, they would get damaged. Hence, for the dispersal of their seeds, most often, plants take the help of external agents like wind, water, and animals. Let's study how seeds are dispersed. Dispersal by wind. In plants like the dandelion, the seeds are small and have tiny hairs around them. When the wind blows, these seeds get detached from the plant and are carried away to distant places. Dispersal by water. Some plants, like the coconut tree, grow near water bodies. Whenever a coconut falls in the water, it floats in the water due to its spongy outer coat and gets carried away by the water to a far off shore. Here the outer coat decays and the seed gets exposed. Dispersal by animals. Many birds and animals, like parrots and monkeys, are fond of eating fruits. They eat the fleshy part of the fruit and throw away the seeds, leading to the dispersal of seeds. In plants like xanthium, the seeds have stiff hooked spines present all over the surface. Whenever any animal passes by such a plant, its seeds get stuck to the animal's body and are carried to distant places. Dispersal by other means. In the balsam plant, the fruit itself disperses the seeds. When the fruit ripens, it bursts open, throwing its seeds far away from the parent plant. This phenomenon is also seen in the castor and pea plants. This is how seed dispersal, or the scattering or spreading of seeds to distant places, is carried out by the wind, water, animals, and sometimes the plant itself. To summarize, for the dispersal of their seeds, most often, plants take the help of external agents like wind, water, and animals. In the castor, balsam, and pea plants, the fruit itself disperses its seeds when it ripens and bursts.